hello everyone today i am going to show you guys how to set the true north and the project north in revit also in the later part of this video i have created the family of north symbol as well but before we start let me remind you to like and share my videos leave a comment below and subscribe to my channel as it motivates me to create more similar tutorials and also if you have any difficulty or query related to Revit, you can ask me anytime. This is where I have left in the previous video. You can see that the north is in the upper direction, but actually the north is towards this side. So I want to rotate the north or I want or I can rotate the building towards the north. So go to site plan. In the properties dialog box, set the orientation at true north instead of project north. You can see in this diagram that the uh, uh, north angle moves in the anti-clockwise direction. So the actual north is at one foot at 135 degree to the true north, but uh, if I want to place the north at 135 degree, I have to give it the angle of 225 degree as it moves in anti-clockwise direction. If I rotate it at, if I give it the angle of 135 degree, it will not be rotated correctly. So now click on this little blue icon here. Go to this angle to true north in the properties box. And first of all, type 135 degree. You can see that the building is not rotated correctly. So, type 225 degree here and then click apply. Now it is fine. The north is in the upward direction, only the building has rotated. If you go to level 1 floor plan, the building is in the straight, building is in the straight direction but uh, the north uh, sign has changed its position. But if I want to, the, the north to be in the upward directions, for that select true north instead of projector. So now the building has rotated. You can also rotate the building manually instead of typing angle in the manage tab but I prefer typing angle in this properties box. If you want to keep the building in this straight position and only want to rotate the angle so select project north from this properties box and then type the angle of 225 degree. And now you can see that the building is in that similar position only the north has changed its orientation but I am going to keep the north in the upward direction so now I am going to load the north symbol in this file so click, go to annotate tab click on symbol click on load family and in the library select north air one and click open you can now place this symbol anywhere in the floor plan but i don't want to use this symbol of arrow i want to create a symbol of my own choice so for that click on file go to new family go to annotation then click on generic annotation and click open Select and delete this. Then go to create tab. Click on line. And start drawing the symbol of your own choice.
Now I want to fill solid black color within this sample. So for that, go to create tab, click on filled, and in this properties box, from here you can select any background. I'm going to select solid fill, then click, and I'm going to keep the color black. Select these lines as shown in the video. And then exit this mode. Save this simple and load it into the project. Now you can place it anywhere you want. That's all for today. I hope you like this tutorial. If you have any difficulties or queries related to Ravi, you can ask me anytime. I will meet you guys in the next video where I will continue from here. Till then, goodbye and take care. And most importantly, don't forget to like, share and subscribe.